Hey everybody, Mr. MathBlog here, and this lesson is 6.8, and it's titled Right Related Facts. Okay, so we're going to do some multiplication and division in this. So how can we write a set of related multiplication and division facts? So uh, related facts are a set of related multiplication and division equations. So uh, what related facts can we write for 2, 4, and 8? All right, so what model can we use to show how multiplication and division are related? Well, we've done uh, arrays, so we'll use arrays of tiles or counters in this lesson to show how multiplication and division are related. So here's the first one. Let's uh, use eight tiles to make an array with two equal rows. Okay, so here's two equal rows. I already have two tiles, these two red guys here. So I'm going to do some more. I'm going to, I'm going to keep going until I, uh, I fill up with eight tiles. So this is two rows. Remember, rows go sideways like this. Columns are the ones like in the Colosseum, those posts that go up and down in the Colosseum. Okay, so there's four tiles. There's plus two more. There's six tiles. There's plus two more. There's eight tiles right there. Okay, so how many tiles are in each row? Well, this row has one, two, three, four. So there's four tiles in each row. All right, so uh, write a division equation uh, for this array using the total number of tiles as the dividend. Okay, so the total number of tiles is going to be 8 because there's 8 total tiles. And the number of rows is the, as the divisor right there. Okay, so we're going to write this as 8 divided by 2 because it said 8 tiles total divided by 2 rows gives us 4. It gives us 4 going across right there. So 8 divided by 2 equals 4. Okay, write a multiplication equation for this er array. Okay, well I have two rows. I have four going across. So two, this two rows times four gives us eight. So two times four would equal eight on that. Okay, all right. So now let's uh, use the eight tiles to make an array with four equal rows. And we'll draw the rest of the tiles. Okay, so there's uh, 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 four tiles right there. There's eight tiles right there. And I'm all done because I've used eight tiles. So they have four rows. There are four rows of two in each row. So when it asks us how many tiles are in each row, there's two of them in each row. Okay, write a division equation for the array using the total number of tiles, which is eight, as a dividend and the number of rows is the divisor. Well the number of rows is four. There's four rows. So this one's going to be eight divided by four equals two. Alright, so we'll write a multiplication equation for this array. Okay, well it was four rows times two in each row equals eight total tiles right there. Four times two equals eight. Okay, so remember eight divided by two equals four. Two times four equals eight. 8 divided by 4 is 2, and 4 times 2 equals 8, and all of these are related facts with each other right there. Let's try this, you guys. Draw an array with four rows, and each row has four tiles in it, okay? So there's four rows, so there's a, a, a one row with four tiles in it, there's two rows with four tiles in it, three rows with four tiles, finally four rows with four tiles. Okay, this array shows the related facts for 4, 4, and 16. Okay, there's 16 total tiles there. There's four rows of 4 right there. So 4 times 4 equals 16. 16 divided by 4 equals 4 right there. Okay, so remember, you guys, when you're multiplying, oops, there goes my phone, sorry, 4 times 4, those are the factors right there. 4 times 4 are the factors, and this is the product right there, okay? We'll review that at the end. So give another set of related facts that only has two equations. Well, in this last one, we had 4 times 4 equals 16, and then 16 divided by 4 equals 4. Okay, so uh, another set of related facts just using uh, the numbers in there. So what if we did something like 3 times 3? Three? 3 times 3 equals 9, and 9 divided by 3 equals 3. Okay, or how about 5? 5 times 5 equals 25. 25 divided by 5 equals uh, 5. Okay, notice these make nice squares. So things that line up with squares would answer this kind of question. They would only give us um, uh, two equations of a related fact right there when you multiply and or divide. Okay, so recall when you have the equation 8 divided by 4 equals 2. The 8 is called the dividend. The 4 is the divisor and the 2 is the quotient. We said that in the a couple of lessons ago and a couple before that also. Okay, or if we have 2 times 4 equals 8, the 2 is a product, I'm sorry, the 2 is a factor, the 4 is a factor, and 8 is called the product. Okay, all right, you guys, take care.